Hi, and welcome to my channel. In this video, I want to talk about the pedal sound in the Hammond B3 and my favorite modification to make it more useful. I'll be doing a series of videos uh, about my music and the way I play, and this is kind of a preparation for that, uh, because you might notice that the sound from the pedal is, isn't always like the original, and so have, if you have seen this, then you know what's going on. So let me give you a few examples. And as you can see here, I have the uh, eight foot drawbar pulled out all the way and then just a little bit of the 16. And here's how that sounds. So for example, uh, my song, the Hellfist Shuffle. <laughs> Or uh, another song called uh, Modron Cafe. And for example, uh, Up and Away. And so my eight foot drawbar in the pedals has a cleaner sound than it, than it usually has. And that's because I've made a small modification. Uh, it's nothing new, but not that common from what I can gather. So I thought it'd be fun to tell you about it. Normally the eight foot drawbar in the pedals is quite useless. It has a lot of these upper harmonics blended into the sound in a way that you can't control. So I think few players ever use it at all. And the 16 foot of course has this rich, full, dark sound, uh, but it can get kind of heavy for certain types of bass lines. So in its original setup, the B3 doesn't provide a way to have a lighter sound uh, in the pedals. You can of course have that sound by playing uh, the bass in the left hand, uh, but I think it's nice to also have that possibility in the pedals. So here's the inside and backside of the uh, Hammond B3. And uh, first, a word of caution. Be so just be extremely careful uh, when you open this up and don't do it if you don't know what you are doing. So with that said, I'm just gonna talk about these cables, uh, these wires that come from the pedals because uh, the sound in the pedals comes in four wires. Uh, it's a, a brown, red, orange, and yellow. And the wires contain two harmonics each uh, of the pedal sound. So you have like the 16 and five uh, and the third, where you have the eight and the four in another, and then the upper harmonics that create that sound we wanna get rid of, like the, so it's the two and two third, the uh, one and three fifth, one and one third draw bar. So they are in the yellow and orange uh, wire. So basically what you can do is just to cut those wires and you won't have those harmonics in the sound. So what I've done is just to uh, uh, install a, a little switch uh, where I can toggle this uh, back and forth. And for me, I, it's not in a very convenient position, but it's because I, uh, I normally always want the modification, so I don't switch back and forth a lot, but it's an easy way to restore the original sound. So let's do a, a comparison of uh, what this modification does. I will just play a scale on uh, each drawbar, each setting, and you can hear the difference. So let's start with uh, 16 foot on the, in the original setup, and that sounds like this. And now let's switch to the modification. So as you can hear, not the big difference, but let's check the eight foot. So here's the original sound. And here's the modification. 
So here you can hear uh, quite a significant difference in the sound. It sounds quite similar to uh, regular left hand bass if we just play the same thing. So I would say that this adds to the possibility of what can be played with the pedals, but it doesn't remove any f uh, essential functionality. Uh, you, can still, uh, you can still use the 16 foot as, as before, just by whether you're uh, like playing notes. Or like thumping and doubling if you're playing left hand bass. And you can uh, you can combine the the sixteen and eight to 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 have like varying degrees of thickness. Uh, so like starting from this, and you can gradually. However, a little word of caution, you shouldn't get too dependent on having this modification because all of a sudden you're playing an organ that doesn't have it uh, and then you need, to, you need to still be able to play and do your thing. So I view it as an option that isn't always available, but it's really nice when it is. On some Hammond clones you can adjust the pedal sound. On the XK5 for example or the new B3 you have a a uh, drawbar setting that kind of uh, uh, models the, the... And you can emulate this mod just by removing the upper harmonics there. And there might be an option coming in Nord products as well, but we'll see about that. Anyway, that was all I had for today. I hope you found it interesting. If you have any questions, just uh, drop a line in the comments. And stay tuned for more videos about the music. Uh, and uh, comment, share, like, subscribe, all that. You know the drill. And see you soon. So I will just uh, play myself out. <laughs>